All right. Well, here's a problem out of the homework. This is number 25 on page uh, 191. And uh, here's how you do it. Let's see. We've got the variable over here. And so we're going to get everything away from it on this side of the equation. So we start by taking off the outermost layer, which is uh, we're going to peel off this negative 5. Now remember, signs go with the number they're attached to. So we're going to do the opposite, which is add 5 to both sides. And so we add a 5 over here. So this becomes a 0. And that's greater than, now this negative 3w is still there, negative 3w. And now this is an imaginary times in there. Remember that, there's no sign, it's times. So in order to undo the times negative 3, we're going to divide each side by that negative 3. So you're divided by negative 3 is 0. And this just leaves a, a w over here. Now, that's not going to work because I divided by a negative, which means I have to switch the direction of the less than greater than sign. Remember that. Now when I go to graph the solution, I put a dot at 0. And now I know that um, there's no line under here. It's 0 is strictly less than w, so it's an open circle. And then I ask, ask myself, which way am I going to shade? Am I going to shade to the right or to the left? Well, a couple ways to remember. The easiest check is to think about the fact that this is saying that the numbers I shade, the w's, are all bigger than 0. Or I can switch this thing around so it's w. Now since I mirror imaged it, I have to mirror image the symbol. And now it, because the variable is on the left, I can follow this arrow and shade the direction it points, which in this case is to the right. So there's my shade. So that would be the graph of the solution. And then finally I should check it. So I pick a number that makes that true, a number bigger than zero. Let's use one. Is negative five. Make sure I stay on camera here. Negative five greater than negative five minus three times one. Is that a true statement? Let's let's see here. I'll come down here and get on the check. Uh, let's see. Do multiplication first. So negative five minus three is negative five greater than negative eight. Yep, it is. So it checks out. So let's pull back here and take a look at the whole problem. There you go. Number 25 from your homework.